everyone, this is Shivani Patel with Go Engineer. In this video, we're going to look into three different ways to add logos to your SOLIDWORKS files. Our first way is going to be through Decals in the Appearances Manager. Now this is the fifth tab, and the second icon which is the Decals, then I'm right-clicking and going to Add Decal. And when I do this, it pops up the Decal Manager from the Task pane, where I can choose from a list of the default logos provided by SOLIDWORKS. Now these types are great because they've been included with properties like reflection that allows them to look more realistic during renders. Now I don't need a fancy decal like that, only a JPEG. So what I'm first going to do is select the face I want to show up on, then go to Browse and find my Go Engineer logo. Now I'm going to see that this decal automatically maps to the face I had selected, which fits itself perfectly. So that was the decal option, the first one. Now let's move into the second option, which is going to be our sketch picture tool. And that's going to require me to create a sketch on the face I want the logo to be on. So after doing that, I'll go to Tools, Sketch Tools, Sketch Picture, and again choose my logo from my files. Now this time, my picture did not automatically size. And I'll have to use the Scale tool to scale down my logo. And uh, 57 millimeters ish should be good. Now let's move this down to the actual face I want it to sit on. Exit my sketch and move into drawings. Now, as I bring in the back view, the view automatically becomes hidden lines removed, of course, and I only see my sketch picture's logo. This is partly because I've ensured that sketches are viewable in my drawing sheet and because I have my sketch set to show inside of my part file. But now I want to show the decal too, not just the sketch picture. Now decals are only viewable in shaded modes, so I have to make my view either shaded or shaded with edges. So a quick summary, decals are better at mapping the faces and be great for rendering, but only show up in shaded views and drawings, and sketch pictures show up in all drawing view types, but sizing them is a more manual process. Now let's check out that third option by adding my logo to the title block. I can go to Insert Picture, choose my logo, and I can see that it accidentally inserted into my drawing view like this, not what I wanted. And these pictures are also movable and they can shift accidentally. Let's just not do it that way. A better practice is going to be inserting the logo into the formatting layer. I get here by right-clicking and choosing Edit Sheet Format. Now I can insert my logo, size it appropriately, and when I get back to my drawing sheet, my logo is going to be permanently placed and demovable. Now this has been Shivani with Go Engineer. I hope this video has shown you how to use either decals, sketch pictures, or inserted pictures to help you add logos to your SOLIDWORKS files. Mm -hmm.